All right, what's up guys? Sanch here, back again with another fitness supplement related video. In today's episode, this is our first episode. So our first episode post contest. Uh, so I'm pretty excited to get back in the gym. It's been, um, it's been two days, three days technically, or four. This will be the fourth day. So this will be the fourth day uh, out of the gym and uh, we're finally getting back into it. Uh, I'm super excited. I've got uh, my trusty weight belt with me. It's push day and we're about to kill it. Got the subs.com t-shirt on, uh, old school one with, with the uh, Ronnie Coleman promotion. Uh, and today we're doing a uh, subs.com um, discount rack supplement review. Today's episode, we're doing another iForce Nutrition product. This one is the Hemoval or Hemoval. Uh, one of you guys um, on the channel here, one of our subscribers, recommended this. So uh, this is part of the Extreme series. I'm going to stop light, so we're just going to chill for a second. Uh, it's watermelon. Watermelon on cooler is the flavor. Watermelon on a cooler. Um, whatever. Uh, I got this for eight bucks, I think. I might even got it cheaper, I can't remember. Uh, half the time, Brent really does hook me up with uh, a great value uh, when it comes to these kind of discount items. Um, like most of them I get uh, on the discount rack, of course, it is uh, hydrated already. It's got, um, it's, it's a little solid, but it's okay. Uh, I was actually, I found once I got past a couple big chunks, the whole bottom layer was pr pretty, for the most part, powder. So uh, I was pretty happy about that. Um, what else? So let's see here. Uh, one serving is 7,500 milligrams, which is about seven and a half grams. So uh, I, what I did is I actually, I doubled that since it's just a pump product. There's no caffeine or stims in it. Uh, well, that's kind of interesting to say because when I think of stims, I think of like citrulline malate, beta, beta alanine, things like that. And that does have that in there. So you really can't say it's stim free, uh, a stim free pump product. It's just, I'm just gonna say a pump product for now until uh, I learn more about it. Uh, I'm sure I'll, I'll ask Price Plow or one of those uh, gurus of the supplement game uh, what their opinion on it is. But um, 15, 15 grams of a pump product we're going to be taking today. Uh, I'm pretty excited. Like I said, it's been about four days out of the gym. So uh, honestly, it's we're going to get right after it. Uh, but that's, that's pretty much it for right now. I'll talk to you guys as soon as I get to the gym. All right, we're back. Uh, Pre-workout, just getting to the gym here. Uh, I've shaken it up quite a bit. This is about 25 ounces of water for two scoops, which is about 15 grams. So do the math. Hmm. Flavor is not bad, but it's not strong. So, tastes really watered down, which makes me wonder about the whole um, seven and a half grams per scoop. Um, who knows? Who knows? The interesting thing is, it says um, one to two servings in 12 to 24 ounces of water. So, I mean, we're almost spot on with the water recommendation. I don't know, guys. We'll see. Uh, flavor test, I'm going to say it's actually great because it's not really potent, it's not terrible, it's not making me cringe. Uh, it's got a nice, nice, uh, consistent flavor to it. And it's not bad. It's not a bad pre-workout taste, so that's a big, big plus to my book. Um, besides that, I'm going to take my uh, nice little tan here and go hit chest. I haven't really figured out what I want to do yet. Uh, I think it's going to be more of like uh, definitely barbell overhead press with um, with the incline, and then um, probably some upper upper scoops. We'll see. We're going to focus on the upper chest. So I will talk to you guys post workout. 
post-workout. Today's episode, following up on the iForce Nutrition's Hemavol. This is their pump product from, uh, what was it called, the Extreme Series. Um, my opinion, for $8, is what I got for the discount one at subs.com, I thought it was a great product. Uh, it says 32 servings per container. Uh, and I'm assuming they're thinking 32 servings of the one scoop. Uh, I'm going to definitely say you're going to need two scoops. Uh, in my opinion, uh, hmm. it's kind of hard to give this one a, a, a review over just one take. So I'm going to actually take this all week. Um, for you, I force nutrition and you, the subscriber, uh, I'm going to give you guys my full opinion on this uh, because... I had a fantastic workout. I don't know if this is the product or not. Uh, I PR'd on weight in the incline press, dumbbell, incline dumbbell press, and the overhead barbell press. I PR'd for weight on each one of those. Um, of course, I have done weight before, heavier weight before, but uh, not in my modern bodybuilding career since, you know, my, my bodybuilding career has actually started now um, with actually competing. So... Uh, great workout fantastic workout i did uh some light ab work in the beginning just to stretch everything out warm it up uh, i'm definitely gonna have to add something substantial at the end maybe some uh weighted crunches and some light grazes things like that so that i don't um lack on the core training um triceps i need to find some tricep movements that i really really love because I noticed that I am uh, lacking on tricep training. Uh, I kind of, if I'm going to skip something, it's going to be abs and it's going to be triceps. Um, so, so that's something I need to focus on myself. Uh, my question for you is, what are you guys lacking on? What are movements that you guys think you guys could train harder in? Because for me personally, I have never trained to the point that, that I'm about to pass out. Now, I, I have a couple times, but not consistently. So, um, and I'll make a whole nother video talking about my, my, uh, review of my contest and my prep for it and my training and my intensity and my dedication, uh, with diet training and, uh, supplementation. I don't know, something like that, but like definitely the first two diet and, uh, weight training. So, um, uh, that's going to be it guys. I do appreciate you stopping and watching the video. Uh, I know I haven't posted in a while, but uh, we're getting back into it. I feel like I always say that, but uh, now with the contest being done, I have a lot more time for you guys. So uh, be ready, be prepared. We got more content coming out. Uh, with the contest video, we will be doing uh, the photos. Eventually I'll get the contest photos. Um, I have to purchase those from some company, which is I think a little silly. Uh, you can just get IFBB photos, but guess for the NANBF and the Natural League, you gotta you gotta buy everything. So, so that is what it is. Like I said earlier, I appreciate you guys stopping and watching the video. If you're enjoying the content, if you enjoyed me mumbling, make sure you like the video, and I'll see you guys in the next episode.